Kyiv. Seven Ukrainian Coast Guards wounded from an attack on their vessel in the Azov Sea on August 31st have arrived in Odessa and are being treated at one of the city's hospitals. This serviceman has severe burn marks and cuts on his face and is lucky to be alive. His commander, Denis Petuchov, and senior sailor Bogdan Tyshenko are still considered missing. Despite their wounds after the explosion, the border guards have tried to save each other. Anyone we saw, we saved. We didn't leave anyone behind. It's hard to remember anything after the explosion, though, but I guess it's because of the shock. Doctors say the worst is over, and the wounded soldiers are on their way to recovery. The injuries vary, but are mostly intense lesions. Primary care was provided firsthand, and we provide the aftercare. We predict that the injuries will fully heal and the wounded will return back to do their military duty. Top Coast Guard officials say the Kremlin-backed insurgents could have only hit the ship with a modern missile, which was most likely provided by Russia. International leaders have long accused Russia of backing, supporting and providing the insurgents with heavy military equipment.